the designer of Zoo Knoxville's new Tiger Forest Habitat Johnson Architecture, hosted a party at the zoo for the project's design-build team, including partners and Blaine Construction. The eagerly anticipated exhibit for the endangered species open to the public this month, and zoo-goers get up-close views of Malayan tigers. This playground is a fitting uh, tribute to Zay, and it provides a place for the children of his neighborhood to play and have fun. Knoxville Mayor Madeline Rojero and representatives from Knoxville's Community Development Corporation and Dow cut the ribbon on the Xavion Dobson Memorial Playground and Park alongside Dobson's mother Zenobia. The play area serves the Lonsdale Homes community and is named in honor of a neighborhood hero who died sheltering friends from harm. Young Williams Animal Center started the week just $1,500 shy of its $23,000 goal to purchase a new x-ray machine and reached it with time to spare. A generous board member matched the goal dollar for dollar bringing the total to $46,000. The 23-year-old x-ray machine will be replaced with a modern digital one for faster and better treatment of injured animals. The Healthy Living Expo is Friday and Saturday at the Knoxville Convention Center with fitness, nutrition, and health screenings. Saturday, the Expo is a site for National Prescription Drug Take Back Day, supported by Count It, Lock It, Drop It, a Blue Cross Blue Shield of Tennessee Health Foundation sponsored program. Steel Recycler Gerdau celebrated Earth Day by hosting a fun activity for students at Lonsdale Elementary School. Each child painted a flower pot, planted marigold seeds, and took their handiwork home to watch the seeds grow into to colorful flowers. Happy Earth Day! The Mox Car Minute. News for you.